how should young couple at the age of 22 plan out their game plan from buying a HDB to a HDB and a condo? Number one, start saving before you get married. Save, 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 save. Then after you get married, still save, 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 because you still haven't have children. So you have opportunity to save a lot of money. All these savings will be used to supplement your capital when you sell your house later. Second, you're young, you have time. Apply for a BTO. Apply, apply, apply until you get one. Apply for at least a four room or five room so that you can maximize your potential profits when you sell after your MOP. In that five years of waiting for your MOP, see if you can do as many partial repayments as possible and clear off your loan so you pay the minimal amount of interest. Sell after MOP at a good price so that that forms your new capital for your condo purchase. Five years has gone by. I hope you have job hopped quite a bit to increase your pay or convince your boss to have that promotion so that now you have a higher salary to, de- to get a higher loan. Use the capital that you just sold from your BTO to go and buy your first condo. It can be any condo, it can be resale market or it can be new launch. But see if it's possible to just use one name. If you buy a resale condo, you can immediately start to stay there. But make sure you buy those, find those rare opportunity, undervalued ones if possible. So that within a short period of time, you can go and cash out if you want. Go and refinance, get an equity loan to get your second condo. If you don't want to do this, if you find it's a bit too risky, make sure you spend a bit more time trying to save up your capital for your next condo. You have another name to use for your second property. Okay, 1 minute 50 seconds. That's the long and short of it. Hope it works out for you.